the ship, the one that is full of big dreams, has a big hole in the waterline. But I assure you, it's too strong to sink. All the crew on board will fight to the last port with all our strength to return the smile to the EF Procycling family that awaits us at the end of the trip. On the day that we lost Rigo and Hugh and uh, then TJ the next day, like it was, it was really, it was really a tough blow. Like we mentally, we were just like, what do we do now? Like we're all here to help those guys. It's been a hard run for us because it's been a tough race, hard to get in the breakaways, and with five guys, you notice that. And actually, we're sort of at the end of our tether. We've been playing Uno every night after the after the stages and just really bonding together as a as a group. The joke is like playing Uno, the card game, with eight guys. It's not that good because it takes so long, you know. And like five is the perfect number to play cards, you know. It's just we can get five rounds in. It's easy. Everyone gets the game. The first time I saw that. For me, it was I wanted to cry. I was so emotional when I saw that. I said, "What are they doing?" And I said, "Guys, can I take a picture of this just for me? Because this is something that I I didn't see that since I don't know when I, I started as a writer, like um, almost 20 years ago." I'm so proud of them. They were ready, and they were the spirit of the of them is really high. And I think that, honestly, the key is that game that they do every night. Muy motivado, fui con la mente de que hoy es el día, Sergio, hoy puedes ganar. Tienes que luchar, tienes que intentarlo, tienes que arriesgar. No hay otro día, voy a ir a la oportunidad. At the top of the final climb, Austin's like, dude, he won. And we just, we all lost it and we just started celebrating. It was, it was perfect timing because we were at the top of the descent and uh, we could all just celebrate with each other. We're all in the same group. So yeah, it was, uh, it was a really special, special moment to have up there. We all started kind of tearing up on the descent and stuff. So no, it was uh, really special. Uh, me alegra haber conseguido la victoria porque hice feliz a mucha gente, no solo en Colombia y mi familia, sino todo el equipo que veníamos intentando, veníamos como superando los momentos y ya hoy es algo bonito porque todos, todos están felices, disfrutando del momento, entonces yo dar la alegría a los demás es algo que, que me llena a mí como de amor, de felicidad. The monster. Ah, it's so easy to work with this guy. With this guy, it's so easy. He's so professional. He's on top of everything, on, on top of every detail. He had like 50, 50 k to go, and we, and we couldn't believe it. I cry. I cry at the end. <laughs> yeah, 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 yeah. I said that today the stage can, they can change their life. And, and at the end, it was true. Everybody was, like half of the people were crying and those who were not crying, they were laughing, they were dancing. You have to put your heart in it. And that's what all the staff and all the riders did. And it's so easy to do one race like the, the Vuelta this year, especially with five riders. They did the maximum. And at the end, believing, we, we had the result. Actually, it really, it hit me so 
deeply when when I heard Sergio won in the radio. And my second thought was, why am I? You know, I was just like, because he's he really is a true inspiration. That guy, like in all essence of that word. And when we were, like I said to you, when we were clacked out, can't make any breaks, and just sort of save, like, in Uno terms, the draw four. And he just had it in the sleeve, and he's just like, wham, guys, today, what you do, stage win, will change your life. So at the end we were fighting to have one stage win and we made it and I think it's, uh, it's enough, it's good. I think everything we, we lived together since three weeks we started this trip, yeah, I think we deserve it. That, uh, My life is changed completely. We listen in the race, Iguita, go! And I think what happened? It's, it's amazing, it's amazing. Iguita, go! No, no say Valverde, no, 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 Iguita, Iguita. I don't write many times tweets. I just use it as a tool for my job. But that day I wake up and say, yeah, I feel this. I was in, in my bed and I said, yeah, it's the moment to, to put everybody on board again. You know, and the boat has a big hole, but it's not gonna go down. That's what I said, and, yeah. and at the end, we fight. <laughs> <laughs>